in this video, I just wanted to introduce you to Bloomberg GPT, which is a large language model from Bloomberg. If you're not aware of Bloomberg, it is one of the premier and pioneer companies in the United States and world over in business and financial information, delivering trusted data, news and insights that bring fairness and efficiency to the markets. Anyway, now coming back to this Bloomberg GPT, which is, which is one example how companies are going to create their own models for their own use cases. They released this model I believe are towards the end of March this year, and also released this research paper, which you can read at your layer, where this new large scale generative AI model is going to set new standards. This has been specifically trained on wide range of financial data to support a diverse rate of a set of natural language processing or NLP tasks within the financial industries. As we already know that the complexity and unique terminology of financial domain warrant a domain specific model. And that is where this model shines. Bloomberg GPT represents the first step in the development and application of this new technology for the financial industry. And Bloomberg believes that this model is going to assist them in improving existing financial NLP tasks such as sentiment analysis, named entity recognition, news classification, and question answering among various other use cases. Bloomberg GPT will unlock new opportunities for marshalling the vast quantities of data available on Bloomberg Terminal to better help the firm's customers. I'm more than sure that other companies are also going to follow the suit and we'll soon be seeing a lot and lot of other company specific GPTs such, like, such as Bloomberg GPT. So we're really excited about this new development. So that's it. Uh, thanks for listening and watching. If you have any feedback, please put it in the video's comment section. And if you'd like, consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you very much.